Well, Dan, building owner Jerry Kehoe missed a May 2nd deadline to complete a structural analysis of that building. Tonight, the building owner put on notice stiffer penalties are ahead. Three months after a five alarm blaze gutted the Dick Broom building, city staff is now going after owner Jerry Kehoe for missing a key deadline. Kehoe received this citation and a $100 fine. In their letter to Kehoe, staff says, unfortunately, we have now reached critical deadlines that are directly tied to public safety. The city is not always the easiest to get along with when you're doing things, but then you do have to follow the rules and you're not above the rules, you know. Last week, Kehoe was to have completed a structural analysis of the Broom building and a timeline for making improvements. Another key deadline is June 17th, at which time all work is scheduled to be completed to ensure the building doesn't collapse. City leaders now concerned Kehoe might miss that deadline as well. Back in March, Kehoe said the city's demands would be met in a timely manner. We have a couple of deadlines. Uh, the 1st of May is a deadline for the final structural analysis and uh, June is the deadline for the final cleanup. And uh, we expect to uh, be well ahead of both of those uh, schedules. This isn't the first time Kehoe has missed a deadline. He missed a March deadline to pull a work permit to clean out the building. That permit still hasn't been pulled. The city has now warned Kehoe missing future deadlines could mean harsher penalties to include fines up to $100,000, to demolish structures or make repairs at the owner's expense, and to incarcerate violators. I'm hoping that um, they'll get whatever they have to do solved with the city. Well, I think that the city is working very closely with the Kios on this, and we hope that this uh, works itself out and they get their permit and move to the next step because they have some, I think, exciting plans for the building. Now, Jerry Kehoe didn't return my call today for comment, so we really don't know what his plans are moving forward. But if he fails to submit that report in two weeks, he'll be paying $200 uh, in the fine. And uh, two weeks later, if he doesn't submit that report, fine goes up to $500. Aaron, Dan. All right. Thank you very much, Felix.